Uh, our next speaker is Big Foot, GMB rep, um, up at BSUH, uh, up in Sussex County. Um, he is very, very active, very supportive, and he is definitely up for the fight. Good morning, everyone. My name is Mick Foot, and I'm a GMB member and a worker at Brighton and Sussex University Hospital Trust. I'd like to thank you all for inviting me to speak today on behalf of the GMB members at your local hospital. I tell you from my heart that I and we truly value your solidarity. Friends, today clearly proves that, sorry, that we are not alone in our forthcoming struggle. Let me tell you, Mr Kershaw, I have a message from you from the staff within your hospital. We have had enough! Had enough of cuts to nurses' wages. Had enough of management tricks. Had enough of the culture of sign here or else. Had enough of pay freezes and price rises. <laughs> had enough of being stripped of bank holidays to help pay for the financial meltdown the directors created. We've had enough of uncertainty and bad management, of damn lies and half truth, of mealy mouth semantics. We've had enough of going to work nervous of the woes that tomorrow and Matthew Kershaw will bring. We've had enough of the constantly. <laughs> Changing Unix sent from on high, while all star appeals for decency only ever fall upon deaf ears. Actually, Mr. Kershaw, let me tell you straight, here and now, before you get cosy behind that new desk of yours, we've already had enough of you! Yeah. Hey. Mr. Kershaw, you should be under no illusion that within your trust, the, st the staff as well as the GMB union, in conjunction with our political allies and the vast majority of the general public, will be ever vigilant to every move you make for every minute of every godforsaken day you spend amongst us. We will make plans against you. We will expose your hidden agendas. We will argue with you over every line of every document. <laughs> we will fight against you for every cut and every job that you wish to nullify and destroy. And you better believe we will come back day after day, week after week. Believe me, Mr. Kershaw, we will never tire. We gathered here today will become the Axeman's own personal nightmare. Yeah, reading his thoughts from the moment he wakes to the moment he goes to sleep. <laughs> I really do hope, Mr. Kershaw, that you brought a good supply of paracetamol with you to your new job, because you're going to suffer from one hell of a constant GMB-induced headache. We care not for Kershaw's nickname or his hard man reputation. These gimmicks mean nothing to us. But I can promise you here and now, Mr. Kershaw, you will be confronted by resistance every step of the way. We in the GMB will not let the lives of the people of this great city and its surrounds be endangered in the same way as the poor people of Lewisham now are. Just because you and your paymasters want to slash and burn our public services in preparation for privatisation. Mr. Kershaw, you are new here and we don't expect you to believe us when we tell you how bad it's going to get for you. But you've wandered blindly and arrogantly into a quagmire and I warn you, it is going to engulf you. Myself and many others here today believe, already believe you have blood on your hands. Sorry folks. Watch. For what you've done to the poor people of South London by destroying their NHS services. So I suggest you pack up and leave now, or just perhaps, if there is one shred of decency contained within your soul, you do the unthinkable, cross the Rubicon, join with us, stand up against your puppet masters, embrace the mass and fight to stop the destruction of our city's NHS services. Friends, they call him the Axe Man. That's all I can say to that. You know what? That's nothing. Because united, together, we will form a rock that will blunt the sharpest axe. Together, we can send Mr. Kershaw packing like the pariah he is. Far, far away from our city and our NHS hospital. So let me end by just 
to stay in it loud and perfectly clear. We will never roll over and let Kershaw and his cronies tickle our tummies, but we will fight with our end to protect our city's NHS hospital, its services and its staff. Thank you for your time. Thank you for your trouble. Goodbye. Well, I have to follow that one.